first. If you have a question, raise your hand and we'll get a microphone to you. Down here in front, on the left. Uh, this is for uh, Jamie and Morgan. You know, seniors want to leave a legacy, and now that you're in an NCAA tournament time, uh, what does advancing past this first round, what does uh, uh, winning a game mean to maybe how you guys want to end your career? Jamie, we'll start with you first. Okay. <laughs> um, since I've been here, we've only won one NCAA tournament game, and that was my freshman year. So being able to play at home and in front of our own fans and our home court is a huge advantage for us, and we're all really excited. But I just hope we come out and win this first one so we get the chance to play again at home. Morgan? Um, I think it's just an amazing opportunity, whether you're a senior or not. It's March Madness, and any opportunity to get to play here on the big stage is uh, really extremely awesome. And uh, we're excited to play that game. And as a senior, we just we want to go out of this building with wins, and uh, one at a time, one at a time. But we're excited for them both. In the middle, Ryan. This one's from Morgan. What have you seen from their center on tape? She's a pretty solid player in the middle. She's a really uh, tall. She's 6'6", six, six, and uh, she moves her feet well, gets up and down on the floor really, really well. So transitioning is going to be key against her. And um, She also likes to turn and get that quick shot. So she's a good shooter, and just being able to pressure her uh, defensively is going to be really important. Ryan again. Sam, this is for you. Uh, the coach, their coach kind of talked about, she thought the way to kind of shut down the Iowa offense was to frustrate you maybe and kind of keep you from distributing the ball. Are you, have you had teams do that and are, what do you, how do you counter that? Well, I think you can't really focus too much on one player on our team. Um, we just have so many different weapons that have stepped up so many different games that I don't think um, a team can really completely stop our team by stopping one player. So um, you definitely just have to use the tools that I have around me to, um, you know, get our offense flowing and keep everything under control. So uh, they can try to, um, but it, it's not just one player on our team, obviously. All right, Jeff. Uh, statistically speaking, they're a pretty good defensive team, giving up a little under 60 points a game. Um, what do you have to do to counter that and attack that? Jamie? Um, I think we just need to play the style of basketball we like to play and get each other involved and really have a variety in our offense. They also like to press a lot, and we've been working on that a lot this week is breaking the press with confidence and taking care of the ball. So I think that would be huge in this game. I agree with Jamie. I think uh, we do a good job moving the ball, and if we uh, keep our spacing well and, and breaking the press, that's going to help us a ton. Front left, Andrew. This is uh, for any of the players. By having these tournament games here at home, does that seem to increase the the amount of time, you know, when you guys are out and about on campus or at the grocery store or whatever, that people mention this or that, hey, I'm there. I mean, do you, you've been to, you've traveled the venues for NCAA. Does it strike you a little more being around that it's more of a local happening? Jamie, we'll start with you first. Um, yeah, I've been, I mean, out and about, and a lot of people have told me that they're really excited to come and watch us and how excited they are that we get a host and that they'll be able to not have to travel to come watch us play. So I think that's really exciting knowing. Hopefully we'll get a great fan base and all the support we've got from our community. Sam? Yeah, um, it's nice to have it even close to home uh, for a lot of us. It's not that far of a drive for families. Um, so I think that helps out a lot too. But our fan base is great all the time. So um, and having a national tournament hosting it um, definitely, hopefully, you know, will increase that. Morgan? Um, like you said, we went. We all went to the men's game last night, and we got a big standing ovation. And you just can tell that, um, you know, the Hawk fans are really here to support athletics, whether it's men or women's basketball. And I really think they're going to show up. And um, they've been supporting us this whole time, whether it's tweets or on Facebook. So I think just uh, they've done a great job showing us that they're here to support us all the way through. All right, Jeff. Um, it's been 16 days since your last game. Tomorrow will have been. And I know Coach has been against the long layoff. Um, uh, Miami people said they've kind of embraced the break. They've gotten a lot better. What, what uh, in your mind, what have 
the Hawkeyes done to have gotten better in the last two weeks? Sam, we'll start with you. Well, I think um, we focused on what was hurting us a lot, and you know, against especially against Nebraska um, in the Big Ten tournament, just uh, boxing out, which we'll really need to focus on tomorrow. Um, you know, and just going through our, all of our sets and everything like that again. But defense, on the defensive end, especially, I think uh, we've been focusing on um, just improving ourselves uh, in that aspect. Morgan. Um, a lot of what Sam said, we worked on rebounding and back to the basics on defense a little bit. And uh, we just continued to grow as a program, go back to those uh, basic fundamentals and work on those every day. Just that continuation has been really good. Jamie. A lot of times during CZ, you don't have time to work on yourselves because you're always getting ready for the next opponent. And I think that week that we had where we didn't know who we were going to play yet, we really focused on ourselves and got better at little things that could make a difference in these upcoming games. So I'm pretty thankful for that. Over here on the right. Okay. Uh, Morgan, at the men's game last night, you were wearing a boot. Is everything okay with you injury-wise? Yeah, everything's completely fine. It's just totally precautionary. So everything's good. Any other questions for the student-athletes?